forget to do it before. So this looks pretty dungy, grungy, dungy, whatever. And that's really pitted. And I got a off. So the real reason it works is that the steel wool uh, is harder than the rust and pit spots but softer than the chrome. So anything you have that's chrome, wipe it down, scrub it with the steel wool, do a test small area just to make sure your chrome is real, like it's real chrome plating. Um, and you'll see it will not scratch the chrome and it will wipe all the pits and rust right off. So it's a really good like polishing, finishing technique, especially for old dingy uh, parts that you're restoring in your car. Grease that end. Just a little bit greasy. Some happy little grease right here. That'll be our secret. That'll be our secret. Happy grease. There we go. It went in. I promise. Use, uh, but you want to use a Brillo or a Solo or any kind of that steel wool scrubby and. It took like five minutes, like all of five minutes. Uh, get a babysitter, set some time aside, maybe call out of work. Um, it might be best just to hire it out, pay someone to restore it, unless you have five minutes. I mean, I only took like two smoke breaks and a nap in there, so it did take the full five minutes. But yeah, it does a good job restoring them. My promises, you know I'm too gentle.